Here are some alternative periodic table ideas. With over a hundred different periodic tables out on the internet today, here are just a few that I found to show you how the periodic table you're using could have been organized. Mendeleev um, originally sorted all the known elements into categories and groups based on physical and chemical properties. And this is what he ended up with originally. Notice there are some holes in there. And um, he predicted that we didn't know about all the elements <coughs> yet and that they would be discovered eventually. Henry Mosley, um, by this time we already knew um, about most of the elements that existed. He improved upon uh, Mendeleev's design by uh, rearranging the periodic table just a little bit and um, expanded, the, expanded the table. This looks an awful lot like the one that we have today. Here are some additional proposed models of the periodic table. Because of the physical and chemical properties of the elements in each family give us a rather uneven or non-symmetrical version of a periodic table, a lot of people have been assuming that there's a better way to group and arrange them. Here's one that's in a circle. Notice hy uh, hydrogen and helium start in the middle, and each period radiates out from that. Here's another one, a variation of the circular, but they also have the lanthanide and actinide series pulled out. Again, this one starts in the center. Um, Einstein would have liked this one, I think. Um, here's a periodic table that is modeled after a um, galaxy. Another one. And yet another one. This one begins on the left and flows to the right. And here's one that have the lanthanides and actinides pulled out separately. All the transitions or short stack elements are on the right here. And it also starts in the center. And there are also some proposed three-dimensional models